Hello, my name is Kerry Sanders. I am the sole inventor of Junior Quarterback Football Board Game, a game that was designed to be the perfect learning tool to teach new beginning football fans how to play football. First of all, I'd like to introduce you to the components of the game. This is your scoreboard, the time clock, the home quarterback, visitor quarterback, referee, ball markers. This is a spinning board. Pass wheel, run wheel, kickoff and punt wheel, extra point wheel, field goal wheel. This is the official game corn. One side represents the home, the other side represents the visitor. This corn is used at the beginning of the game to determine who gets possession of the ball first. This is your bonus dice. This is the live dice. This is the defense dice. This is the most important dice for the defensive player. I'll get back to that later. This is your bonus deck. On the inside, determines the movement. This card indicates free ball. This card is sort of like you get out of jail free. If a player pulls a free ball card, he can keep stick the card and hold it to the duration of the game and use it at his leisure in the event of any type of turnover. Okay. Back to the run and pass wheel. Offensive player chooses to do the run wheel first. He spins the run wheel and it lands on the green dice. That indicates the bonus dice has to be rolled to determine the movement. Office player uses the run of pass wheel and it lands on anything that say live. This indicates a live fumble. That means the offensive player fumbled the ball, defensive player rolls the live dice to determine additional move. This here is the defense dice. This dice is used by the defensive player after the offensive player spins the run of pass wheel. In this case, he spins the run wheel and it lands on 15 yard gain. Offensive player is not allowed to use to move the ball until the defensive player rolls the defense dice. If it lands on no play, no play was made, the offensive player can free to, freely move what the uh, spinning board says. If it lands on fumble holding, he has to move accordingly. Each game consists of a how to play manual. This manual explains in detail how the game is played. On the back here is our YouTube video, which we invite you to refer to, and it goes further in detail explaining how the game is played. I'd like to thank you for allowing me to present to you Junior Quarterback Football Board Game, a game that I know will be in household for many generations to come.